the September surge may be coming to an end, but seasonal work and contract work are just getting started and so are you. We're gonna be going over nine remote jobs that are hiring for seasonal and contract work right now in Q4 to help you get a little bit of extra money for the holiday season or potentially transition into full-time work. This video is also going to be just a little season and a little taste, a little sizzle of the content that I have in store for you. I have 50 remote seasonal jobs hiring right now that are looking to start between today, today and October 31st. So if you want to get a head start, if you want to get ahead of the game, if you want to get that brand new job to make your Q4 the best quarter that you potentially can financially, then let's get to it. You want to hit that link down below in the description box and you want to keep watching along with this video. Welcome back to another Millennial In Debt video. My name is Melissa, aka Millennial In Debt. If you are new here, hit that subscription button below, turn on the notification bell so you get that every single time I upload a video. Before we get into the nine different companies that are currently hiring for seasonal remote work, let's talk about two important tips that will help you get that job, help you get that role. The first thing is you want to start early. That's why I'm here with you right now, giving you all those opportunities. Like I said, I've got 50 remote seasonal jobs in the description box below if you want to get your hands on that free resource. The second thing besides starting early, getting ahead of all of the traction, getting ahead of the holiday season, is to make sure that you state clearly on your resume that you have remote experience. Say it either in your skills section of your resume or you're going to state it directly next to the particular role job title that you have had. For example, I was an educator for 11 years. So in those last few years during the Panini, I would state that I have experience working remote, creating digital resources and things like that to help me stand apart from other applicants that are going to be going out for similar or the same roles. Are you ready for those roles? Are you ready for the jobs? Are you ready for the companies? Because I sure as hell am. We're gonna start off in the finance section. We have the company JDATSG. I got that on my first try. And they have a ton of different seasonal positions. One of the positions that are currently available is a tax team lead. For this particular role, they are currently offering $34 an hour. Some of the skills that they are looking for is previous tax experience. You also have to be CPA licensed. That is a requirement. As of the CPA license, they do want you to have customer service experience as well as any supervisor or managerial experience. So if you were a team lead, a manager in your previous you know, job, previous role, or you've done any leading training, lead training, then this is a position that would be really great for you to apply for seasonal work, additional income during Q4. The next role is a travel sales associate for AAA Club Alliance, currently paying $16.50 an hour. They do offer paid training. The first five weeks would be paid training from Monday through Friday, 9 to 5.30. After that, you would have a regular five-day schedule, but one of those days would include a weekend day. You do get all the computer technology things sent to you from AAA Club Alliance and you get to work from home from anywhere as long as you are in one of their territories. They do require a high school diploma or equivalent and they are looking for anyone who has had 12 to 18 months of sales experience or who has been a triple A travel counselor. The next role is from the Popcorn Factory. They're looking for a customer service associate for seasonal work. They did not say how much they're offering to pay, but the ad does say that they are a competitive pay rate. Competitive to who, Popcorn Factory? We want to know. They are looking for anyone with excellent communication skills, a high school diploma or equivalent, a GED. They also would like the person to take this role to have previous call center experience and you will have to go through a background check. This role was just posted four days ago, so run, don't walk if it is of interest to you. The company Minted is currently looking for a customer service representative. They are looking for someone who has one year of experience. They are also looking for someone who has a minimum of a bachelor's degree. The current pay rate is based off where you are geographically but it looks like it starts off at $17.50 an hour for a majority of the states in the U.S. Your daily task would be answering phone calls, replying to emails, providing customer support, and they are looking for someone who has Salesforce or CRM experience. That is a bonus, not a requirement. I think we're on five. Is this number five? You let me know. I'll know in the post edit. The fifth company is Papier right? Papier, if you want to, you know, I, I speak French, so we're going to go Papier. And they are looking for a customer service agent and the pay is $21 an hour. The fixed contract would start on November 1st, so they are looking to hire rather quickly all the way through January 31st, where you would get six paid holidays, I'm sorry, five paid holidays and six paid days off. They are also offering a friends and family discount on all of their stationery. I like Papier. 
companies six and seven. This is also for my tax experts. It looks like seasonal work is a lot of customer service rep or tax prep in preparation of tax season coming up real soon. So Legal Zoom and Baker Tilly are both looking for tax representatives that can essentially do taxes. LegalZoom has not provided the specific pay rate, while Baker Tilly is offering $23 to $27 an hour. Both require you to have a CPA license or an EA equivalent and three to five years of tax preparation experience. Under Armour is company number eight. They are currently looking for customer service representatives. You guessed it. They have not specified the pay, but they are looking for someone especially bilingual. If you are bilingual, you're in there like swimwear. Do people? Anywho, they, anywho, girl, how old are you? All right now, they are looking for people who are bilingual to help during their busy holiday season. You would be providing support through their social media platforms, as well as phone, chat, and email. And last but certainly not least is National Debt Relief looking for a client success agent. They're looking to have the person who filled this role start on October 30th. So again, if you are watching this, I'm going to be trying to get this up by October 5th. Run, don't walk and apply to this specific role. While this is a remote role, they are currently only accepting people who live in these states. I know. I hate that shit too. And they're looking for someone who has a high school diploma or equivalent, as well as someone who has two years experience working in a relationship-based support role. And there you have it, future millionaires. If you found this video helpful, give it a little thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you are looking for 50 more roles, I promise they're not all customer support, but a lot of them are. If you're looking for 50 more companies that are offering seasonal work right now, hiring right now, looking to hire you right now, you want to head to the description box and click that link and I will catch you in the next video. Peace.